If you try to launch the game and you get this error message which says the operation was cancelled by the user with an error code which is 0x4c7. So the operation was cancelled by the user 0x4c7 and this occurs when you try to launch the game on Steam. Now to fix this issue is very easy. The first step you need to try is verify integrity of game files on Steam. So just open Steam. Then go to your Steam library and you'll find the section where you have the list of games here. So right click on the game where you face the error and go to properties. Go to installed files and select verify integrity of game files. Now this will try to check for any corrupted files and it will try to repair it. And after that, after the verification is over, you can try to relaunch the game. Now if you have do so but you still again face the same issue. Now, it's probably you have a broken EA app installation. So in, in most cases, if you verify integrity of game files, but you're still first again the same issue, you have a broken EA app installation. Now to fix this, you should repair the launcher, which is EA launcher. So open Steam, go to the game where you face the issue. So open Steam, go to your Steam library. Now right click on your game, then go to properties, then go to installed files, and then select Bruce local files. So after browsing to local files, you will be taken to the section where your game has been installed. Now look for the EA app installer. Double click on it to run the installer. So just open Steam like this. Now right click on your game where you face issues, select properties. Then go to installed files and select here browse. So just browse here to installed files. It will take you to the section where your game has been installed. Now also on the section there, look for the EA app installer. Double click on it to run the installer. After the installation is over, you can try to relaunch the game to see if the issue has been resolved. You know, if you've installed the, if you've double clicked to run the installer, but you, you're still facing again the same issue, now launch and sign, sign in to the EA app. So launch and sign in to the EA app. So just look for the EA app here. So just come to the home screen here. There is EA app. So just open, open the EA app. The EA app has been opened. Make sure to sign in to your EA account. If you don't have EA account, make sure to create one and sign in using your emails or using your Steam account. After signing into the EA app, then you can try to relaunch the game again. So just make sure to launch the EA app. If you don't have the EA app, just make sure to download one. The link will be available in the description. Or just go to ea.com slash EA dash app and you'll be able to download the EA app for your Windows or Mac OS. So if you don't have the EA app, make sure to download it one. And after that, try to launch the game to see if your issue has been resolved. And once you've downloaded the EA app, just make sure to launch and sign in to the EA app. Make sure you are signed in to the app and you try to launch the game to see if the issue has been resolved. You know, if you do so, but you're still again facing the same issue, now run the game executable file as administrator now go to the game where has been installed then run the game which is exe file as administrator so right click on it and then run it as administrator also you can try to disable temporarily any antivirus program so if you have any third party antivirus program or you have any windows defender or any other antivirus program just temporarily turn it off or disable temporarily any antivirus program to see if the issue can be resolved now this is the best guide for the operation was cancelled by the user with an error code which is 0x4c7. So make sure to follow the instructions very carefully and you'll be able to resolve this problem.